Good morning guys, what's up? Well, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. It's 8.30 a.m. Monday morning. I thought I would do a week in my life because I actually feel up for it right now. I had a really good weekend and I had a very, very depressing last week and just overall depressing last few weeks. I don't really even know how to describe it because it's not like some dramatic event happened in my life that caused me to be depressed, but I've just been in such a depressed mood. Just sad for no reason, not wanting to do anything. The things that normally like bring me joy and excitement give me no emotion. And it's just been like so sad and depressing. I've already done all of my crying, so we're not gonna do that right now. But I just wanted to say sorry. I do uh, think I'm back now though, like normally, <laughs> hopefully, because I said that before and then things kind of went downhill again. But I do think I, I mean, I feel better now than I have in a while. So let's go to work. Just got to work. I wanted to really quick show you guys my nails because I have been doing my nails, as you guys know, for a really long time. With the exception of when I got married in February, I have not gone to the nail salon since October of last year. So like we are a few months away from it being an entire year of me just doing my own nails. And I wanna say I've gotten really good. I mean, I'm not like perfect or anything. I'm still learning, but like, can we just take a minute and let me show you this side. Like I did this myself and when I tell people, like my sister, she's like, what, how did you do the design? She's thinking I'm using like a um, strip or like, you know, something that, uh, like a stencil or something. Like, no, I hand painted it. And if you look closely, like it's definitely not perfect. Um, you can see like it's a little bit like bulgy almost in some spots because you know, I'm not perfect yet, but like I have come so far and I'm so proud of how my nails look. It's been honestly like a lot of fun doing them. I did these on Friday when I was super depressed and it was just like something for me to focus on for a few hours. It's kind of like therapeutic when I do my nails. I really enjoy it. It's five o'clock now, I just got out of work. The last two to three hours were a little bit hard for me because I was getting so tired, you know, that like afternoon slump. I'm just like yawning and like it becomes really hard for me to focus. <laughs> but we powered through and Chad texts me to pick up bow tie pasta for what we're doing for dinner tonight. I guess we didn't have any and we thought we did, so we didn't buy any when we went grocery shopping yesterday. So I'm gonna stop at Publix really quick and grab that and then I'm heading home. I am home. Chad is cutting up onion and carrots for our soup that we're making. And this is the Italian noodle soup recipe that I've talked to you guys about before um, with the um, spicy chicken sausage that we do. Also picked up a little treat while I was at Publix. An almond coffee cake. How delicious. Publix coffee cakes are the absolute best. We had the guava one. Now we're having the almond coffee cake. Good morning, guys. It's Tuesday. I just woke up a little bit ago. It's 7. I took my nails off last night. And I know you're thinking, those nails were so cute. Why would you take them off? But I actually had two of them pop off while I was at work yesterday. And I was so sad because those were the cutest nails that I've ever done. Um... But they popped off because I'm dumb and I didn't file the inside of the nail extension before I put them on <clears throat> because I always just thought like it was an extra step. I've never had any nails pop off before so I just didn't think it was important but clearly that's the reason that I was never having nails pop off. So make sure you file the inside of the extension if you do um, your own nails. So yeah, once two of them popped off I was like I'm done. So I just took them off and I'm gonna do like some really quick nails this morning just so I have something because I like can't have nothing on my nails. It drives me crazy. getting ready I didn't have time to do my hair so I just put it up and then I put this little um, 
headband thing in it. Kind of matches the skirt that I'm wearing. And I'm gonna really quick do my nails as fast as I can. I have like 15 minutes. Just got to work. I ran through Starbucks really quick. I didn't even vlog because I was like so fixated on not being late. And I'm actually early. <laughs> but for me, if I'm not early, I'm late. I like have to be early. Also, if you didn't know, I think for the whole month of July, uh, cold drinks at Starbucks are 50% off on Tuesdays. So that's why I'm treating myself. Technically, yesterday would be like my one time of going for the week, but I decided to treat myself. And I'll probably do it again because when drinks are 50% off, I feel like I can like go two more times than I normally would because it's only a cost of one. I have a dentist appointment today at four o'clock to get a filling. I am absolutely terrified, but Chad can't come with me this time because he has to take Trooper to his like vet appointment, just, you know, routine visit. So he can't go with me. So I have to go by myself. I'm going to be leaving work a little bit early, probably like 3.30 to head there. And I am so scared, but this one should be really minimal. It's not like I needed the filling. He's just fixing a previous one that he had done a year ago. I don't have to pay anything for it because it was so recently done, like last year. Um, so he's just like fixing it. So he said I might not even need to be numbed. So fingers crossed I don't have to be numbed because I really don't want to be numb. Okay, I just got here. So this is what my desk looks like. I literally just moved it over here because we're making that whole side a shipping station for Nurture Choose, which is one of the brands that they own. Wow, I really just left all the tabs open on my computer yesterday and just turned it off and went home because <laughs> everything's still open. It's almost 11 o'clock and I am heading to Walmart. I need to get some stuff for us to organize and nurture choose because that's the newest product that they have under nurture brands which is the pet brand so um i am gonna go grab stuff so bins and supplies and kind of like how i want to organize the shipping station so it's really beneficial because doing sun styled and having my own business has helped me tremendously in implementing the same kind of things into their businesses when i'm working you know under them and it's really really helpful because i already know what like works and doesn't work from doing it myself so it's kind of cool and they like give me the creative freedom to choose how i want to set things up which i love got everything i needed at walmart literally a ton of bins and then we got a cube organizer thing and i'll probably be building that when i get back to the office i also got a red bull because a sugar-free red bull but i've been really wanting to have one of those i used to drink the sugar-free red bulls when i was in college and i haven't had one in so long and it just sounded good so i got a sugar-free red bull i'm also sweating to death because it is like 100 degrees outside right now I just got to the dentist I'm so anxious about going in here I didn't even feel that anxious earlier and now I feel like so anxious about it and it doesn't help that I always get really bad car sickness whenever I'm in traffic and the entire drive here was like straight traffic I'm so glad I left when I did I left earlier than I was initially gonna leave just thinking you know there might be some traffic getting over here because of where it's located and there was really bad traffic so so glad i left when i did because i'm like 10 minutes early but yeah does anyone else get nauseous when they're in traffic like i get the worst nausea and like anxiousness i mean I'm, of course i'm on my way to a dentist appointment but like even if i'm not on my way to a dentist appointment when i'm in traffic i get like nauseous and anxious so i'm just sitting here driving trying not to start panicking because i am sitting here just getting a quick filling i probably won't even need to be numbed this is gonna be no thing at all. It's 412. I was literally in there for less than 15 minutes and then my time in the chair was probably five minutes. I'm not even kidding. It was so fast. I would have not even got worked up if I would have known it was going to be that quick. 
I didn't have to be numbed or anything um, because I guess they weren't like redoing an entire filling. He just had to like take off a small top layer of it to kind of, it was like more of a preventative thing because he could see it potentially becoming an issue. Um, and then just refill that spot. Good morning guys, it's Wednesday. I just got to work. I actually brought a coffee today because I decided not to get Starbucks again. Proud of myself. And I just got here, I actually didn't even brush my hair because it was like still wet when I got out of the shower this morning. So I just brought my hairbrush with me. So it looks like a rat's nest right now. But yeah, I'm about to get started. Today's my half day, so I'm only here until 1230. It's now 12 o'clock and I actually just got to Allison's apartment because she's going to help me model with Tater. If you guys remember Tater, her dog, it's going to help me model some of the nurture beds. Um, we really need to model the pink one, so we're going to make Tater look like a girl. And it's gonna be great. I end up leaving work a little bit early because I need to do these photos. So I'm at her apartment now and we're gonna take pictures. Hello! I'm gonna insert some pictures on screen of Tater modeling the nurture bed. He did so good. He modeled the pink one and then we also took some in this other one. And he did amazing. Is uh, his party trick? Yeah. Talk shit. Talk shit. Talk shit. <laughs> <laughs> he has to do it more than once. You're a ding dong. Good job. I just got off of a meeting, even though I'm technically done work for the day. I was asked to jump on this meeting, so I just got finished with that and I edited all the photos, posted them. Um, they turned out really good. And I'm officially finished with my work day from there. Now I'm gonna work on some stuff at home that I need to get done. It's five o'clock. I'm at World of Beer with Allison. I just got a blueberry beer. It's called. Um, Secret Llama. Blueberry wheat ale. Allison's drinking a very sour, sour. sour. And she's got this one here with us. He's like so good. <laughs> he was a very good boy. <laughs> we were gonna bring Trooper, but I didn't know if I should. <laughs> He's crazy. They're both crazy. We're about to start cooking dinner and I really quickly want to give a shout out to our place. They sent me a new pan. This is the Everything Cast Iron Pan. So the other one I have is the same color in the spice color, but that's just their regular Everything Pan. And then I also got a new cutting board and this is so nice. This is actually the nicest cutting board ever. We're gonna get rid of our old one for this because it's so much better. And now I'm just super pumped because we have another one of these pans. It really is my go-to pan for everything. And this one actually came with these silicone covers to protect your hands from the heat, which I think is awesome. We're having tacos for dinner tonight. And I just cut up some lettuce and tomato. Oh, and you also made rice? Good morning, trooper. This is a life my dog lives, everybody. I was just snuggling him, but now I have to get ready for work and he loves it when I put a pillow between his paws like this because usually I like lay between his paws. Sleepy boy. Sleepy boy. I definitely laid on the couch with Trooper for way too long this morning, so now I'm rushing. I'm just going to run this straightener through my hair really fast and then we're going to go. I put this lip stain on my lips and then a gloss and it looks like super red, but it will calm down. It's just like a stain, so I wanna keep it on there for a few minutes and then it kinda of like leaves the color on there all day, but it will be a little less drastic than this. But I'm excited, cause today I get to go babysit Callie. And the days that I get to go babysit Callie are my favorite days of the week. I just rushed out of the house so fast, you guys. I was very frantic this morning. Chad always says he knows when I'm being frantic in the morning or when I like didn't prepare enough time to get ready because the way that I leave the house in destruction, it looks like a bomb went off because I'm like just running around everywhere. I don't really mind on the mornings when I'm going to see Callie because like I'm just going to hang out with Callie all day. Like it's just a chill morning. It's the days when I go to work that I like have to be up super early and like plan out my time. The days I go watch Callie, I'm just like, it's fine. I'm with Callie, it's 12 o'clock now. I've been here all morning and we're watching Moana. And I'm actually working in Adobe InDesign. I'm designing a new planner, and this one is gonna be even cooler. I mean, every time I come up with a digital planner, it's usually better than the one before because I just feel like I'm getting better at it. But I'm using InDesign now instead of uh, Keynote, and it's a process, like learning this new program, but oh my gosh, I can do so much more, so it's pretty cool. Look at her, she's so big now. You are so big now. 
When did you get so big? <laughs> she literally has a chrome on her eyebrow. I just ate lunch. When I started watching her, I was like, oh, this will really help the baby fever. I'll get my like baby fix. I'll spend some time with the baby and then I'll be okay. I won't want to have a baby, but like, look. I just want a baby more now. I am at World of Beer again, second time this week and I haven't been here in so long. And I'm with Jennifer and Sarah. Jennifer, you look so pretty. <laughs> Thank you. Just ordered really funny video the pretzel Sarah. with beer cheese. <laughs> and I got a mimosa. Good morning guys. I do a little Nordstrom haul of like some skincare stuff that I just got from them. One thing I've been using a lot lately this entire week that I actually really, really like is this Tan Lux water. I've been using this for an entire week and I'm, I spray a lot and it's like barely gone. So I'm really glad I got the bigger one though. Whenever I spray tan or even just tanning outside, like I always have sunscreen on my face. So my face tends to be the palest part of my body. So I really like using that because it kind of evens out my skin tone and makes it match the rest of my body. This stuff's awesome. I'm gonna link it in the description. I've been using the Super Goop Glow Screen. The other one that I used to use last year because I love Super Goop was the um, Unseen Sunscreen and that one's really good too. But this one is actually like gives your skin a little bit of a glow. So if you're gonna wear it under makeup, probably the other one, the Unseen Sunscreen, but the Glow one is good if you just want like your natural skin to have a glow, it's kind of nice. My skin right now, minus a little breakout, I mean, but like, my skin's been looking pretty good, and I'm telling you, one product, this, the freaking CEO Glow. I had heard about this a lot, but I didn't really want to purchase it because it was kind of expensive, but this stuff will make your skin literally glow and glisten and just feel like really, really healthy and hydrated. Plus it comes in like super cool packaging. But yeah, shout out to Nordstrom. Thank you for gifting me these products. They're celebrating clean beauty right now. Their goal right now is to recycle 100 tons of beauty packaging by 2025, which is crazy because I know that like this stuff produces so much waste. So I think it's cool that they're like working to actually do something about that and sustain raw materials. So these products fall into that clean beauty category, which is awesome. I will link them in the description. And seriously, just like take a minute. My skin has never looked so good. I'm not saying it's just because of these products. I mean, I've definitely been taking care of my skin more, but the CEO glow really, really makes my skin glow. We're heading to go do something we haven't done in a long, long time. Or the last time we did it was raining. <laughs> well, yeah, we got like three minutes in before it started pouring rain. Yes, we're going to play tennis. I'm so excited. We're gonna sweat. way later now i didn't vlog anything today you guys i mean other than this morning us going and playing tennis i had a really lazy day and it was very very nice after such a productive week but cheers because i just poured myself a glass of wine i redid my nails earlier so i guess it wasn't a completely lazy day because i did redo my nails but like i didn't do my normal sunday stuff like doing laundry and cleaning the house and all that i'm just like can't be bothered with it right now i'm actually about to play some xbox right now so 